European people to Germany every year. I know somebody right next to me who might have enjoyed some Oktoberfest over the weekend. Uh, I'm guilty. <laughs> you know what? Carly and I, we, we, we did it up, and I have to say, I got my uh, chicken dance on. Had a good time. I saw the picture of that chicken dance. Clearly, you should do that on camera. I know. <laughs> <laughs> might scare everyone, but we do have pictures on our Twitter accounts and Facebook, so if you guys want to check them out, I'll tell you what, it was a fun weekend. Definitely uh, had, had a good time. Here's a look at your planner for today. We are starting to see those showers moving to the area. By the way, the chicken dance. Do you guys do the chicken dance, both of you guys? <laughs> no. Oh, come on. See, this is what we need to do on the morning show, show everybody how we can do this. We're going to see the chance of those showers coming in throughout the daytime period, and we could even get a few sun breaks. Now, yesterday, we had those winds gusting up around 35 miles per hour. Expect winds to not be as strong today. We could still get some gusts up to around 20 miles per hour. And where we do see the sun breaks today, we could get a few isolated thunder showers, so just be aware of that as our highs top off right around 64 degrees. Now, as we look out this morning, we do have rain showers in the area, 57 right now with the south wind at 6 miles per hour. So those winds are pretty light this morning. But what we're looking at mainly on the coast is where we're seeing some of the higher wind gusts up to around 25 miles per hour in Newport along the I-5 corridor. We're looking pretty good this morning. But we have been seeing those showers moving in uh, off the coast, actually moving into the I-5 corridor in the metro area this morning. So it's going to be a wet start for you. Have a, a rain jacket handy when you head off to school this morning. Kids at the bus stop, even down towards the Salem area, starting to see some of those showers. Uh, getting close to your area, just up towards the north, but I expect those to be moving in very shortly. Now, most of us are starting off in the low to mid-50s this morning, out towards the coast, 55 in Astoria, and 50 seven degrees for you in Salem. So we have a stream of moisture that's going to be pulling in today. That's going to keep us unsettled today and especially tomorrow. So as we look at the rain and cloud forecast, scattered showers today. Again, a few sun breaks possible, maybe even a thunder shower. I'm going to stop the clock around 6 p.m. so your commute home does look like we will have showers in the area. Overnight tonight will stay mostly cloudy with the chance of a few showers. By tomorrow morning, models are trying to indicate a little bit of heavier activity coming in, mainly an isolated thunderstorm between about Salem and Eugene. Not out of the question there. Tomorrow, though, we get a little bit more instability working in here, and I do think that we'll see some scattered uh, thunderstorms possibly developing in the area. So something to watch uh, tomorrow. Now, right around 61 in Seaside, 60 in Newport for today, slightly warmer in the valley. We will be wet at times, though, with a few sun breaks possible. 69 in Burns, a little breezy east of the mountains today, and especially through the gorge with those winds up to around 15 to 30 miles per hour. Government camp, your high right around 47. Check out the snow level, though, 6,000 feet with a low near 39. For us in the metro area, right around 64 degrees with a low near 53. So tomorrow is the better chance of seeing a few thunderstorms coming in. Our highs are going to stay in the lower 60s both, day, uh, both days. And then Thursday, we dry out. We could have some patchy morning fog, and it could be dense at times, and that could also be on Friday morning. Friday right now looks dry, but then another system comes in over the weekend, giving us a slight chance of showers still uh, out uh, a distance away, so we'll watch that as it gets closer. But